What's up, friends of the good mood? This is Money, and welcome to Soma again with um, the continuation of our playthrough. I wish I could heal up because this this obstructed vision and uh, is annoying me a little bit. Maybe I have to take these things down and have to do something somewhere else with those things. There is no computer here. We have to use some kind of computer interface here. Um, did these uh, rooms have computer? I wish I knew Brandon better. What would make him talk? Ah, Brandon is his name. That's right. Uh, Master Tool Safety. What is this? What? Master tool safety. Is this the room of Brandon? No. Okay, let's let's search for Brandon's room. You know room. what? Go look Here we go. Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Ah, we're on the right track. Haha. <laughs> if we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. Yep. Okay, let's see what we have here. Uh, a uh, Acre finally agreed. Acres finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Uh, Goya Cryer and I moved into Theta today. Acre said he'd stick around for a while longer. That's crazy. That crazy bastard. I take pride in my work, but goddamn, that place is miserable since its surface stopped sending parts. Did my arc scan today with Alice? Brandon mentions a girl named Alice. They did their scans together. Alice cost her. We could try to make him think that she's there during the simulation. Might make him talk. Not sure how, though. Keep looking. Gomaya told me that the hangover would basically kill me. Such an asshole. <laughs> I was fine at first, but got a, split, uh, a splitting headache a couple of hours later. Uh, the biggest pain was that Chun girl. She's so freaking uncomfortable all, all the time, it makes my skin crawl. Gomayo went ba uh, ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Apparently, Conrad wanted in, uh, wanted in on the continuity and just fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll we'll be getting new security ciphers. Just heard that the Camerobi survey team is going to Data Delta to pick up Acres. He'd been alone for months now. Can't imagine what he's been up to. Okay. Cute. Cute, yeah. Is it this, uh, is this the girl Alice, maybe? It annoys the heck out of me that I have this uh, this vision that, that this guy hurt me so much that I can't see right. What is that? Fairchild Award. Fairchild Award for achievements of the engineering youth. Okay. Okay, like Venice or something. All right, some temple. Waiting for Straskin, I'll borrow to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. They wanted to take that I skin. I just heard Alice talking to Brandon on the intercom. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. Great, this is exactly what we need. I think we got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom. 
and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Good yeah. job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. <laughs> so it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. <laughs> Okay, so a healing uh, thing would be good. Next time I see a healing thing, I'm not going to use it unless I'm actually hurt. Because it's really awful when you have to walk around like this for a very long time. Oh, wait a minute. That was closed a minute ago. That was closed. You see this open door? It was closed. Something crawled out of it. That's not good. Let's say it how it is. That sucks. Can I close it? Told you that wasn't going to be good with all that blood. I compiled an Alice module that we can use. Shh, so she'll be, be with quiet. Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. Alice will be talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> Loading data. Okay, loading data from chip one. There two. Let's use the scan room because that's the, the obvious choice. And then module is Ellis. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. Well, that's what you get for listening to his stories. I guess I had it coming. About Strohmeyer. He said he needed a new site for ASAP. What should I tell him? It's alright. I can talk to him. Wait. Didn't Chum just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry, I'm not gonna tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42. 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. No, I only have the first four. I'm sorry, Mr. Long. Brandon. Goodbye. No, wait. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. I won't shut I won't erase them. I shut them down. Um, because who knows what will happen, but I, I don't feel comfortable with deleting the, the last pieces of consciousness of people. That's not what I am. Okay, so... Um, could you please tell me that code again? I have to get back to the uh, Omni chip now. Yeah, perfect, but you do realize there's a million monsters along the way, probably. So it's easier said than done to come back. I'm not going to sprint. Unless I see no... Couldn't we just have extracted the cipher from Brandon's data somehow? Ah, so thank cool goodness. Bringing him back like we did. No, that's impossible. Memories don't work like that. Oh. Thank goodness we are now back on full health. Which means that one of those aliens or things could probably punch us in the face one more time. And we wouldn't immediately die. I'm, 
That's not good. I wish that gate was closed. Okay, so let's get that Omni chip and be out of here. There you are. Just warming up the Dunbat for us. It's been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. Oh, we okay, may. That's it. We that's may not have a minute. Everything. Let's go ahead and. Huh. That's weird. Huh. Never mind. What do you need me to what? do? Head inside the dock. The Omni tool can open the door now and get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in and I'll take us into the Abyss. Sounds easy enough. Ha ha ha. Easy. Sure, it's gonna be super easy. Oh man. Oh man. What? I, I must be crazy to be doing these kind of things here. Easy enough, she said. Yeah. Uh, this door, right? Yep. Oh, you know what? I'm pretty sure that will basically take some time and I have to kind of hang in there. That the one bot? Nah, what the bad thing, but whatever. Okay, I can move this. All right, it doesn't go in there. to get up somewhere maybe there yeah probably huh okay let's see if that works huh okay that's not how it works Oh gosh, more riddles. Watch out for the moving door. Okay. Anything I can press here? Any buttons? No. There is something blinking. Ah, hello. Cluck. Blocked in. Okay, so far so good. Why was that happening? The 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 rope this thing was also a robot that was like it has a conscience and it was wonderful. Just great. It's still down there. I can see it. It's alive, I think. We have to convince it, maybe, to take us in. This is just great. 
now that I thought we were finally going to be able to get into the, to the Ark, this happens. Ow. Okay, wrong way. At least we don't have any monsters crawling around with us here. For now. <laughs> Plan B. Achievement unlocked. Okay. And the game has saved again. Mm. I'm not making any move. Okay, we do have monsters now. Is something with me here? In this in this little vent? Because that would suck. That would really suck. And this one thing we've seen before, that was not a robot. That was some kind of living creature, I think. It didn't look like a robot to me, more like a mutant. those health things I wonder if I can leave it there and not use it unless I need it on the other hand though it has a lot of wires connected that we may have to somehow activate I don't know all right so let's uh, talk to Catherine and tell her what happened. Huh? Wait, this isn't... Oh, no! Wow got to the Dunbat before we did, am I right? Well, it was talking. That's rarely a good sign. Damn it. The Dunbat was our best shot. I was really banking on this to work. Come on, we can't quit now. There's gotta be another way. Hmm. How do you think you did it? How did the team get the Ark down the Abyss in the first place? If they didn't use the Dunbat, the only other way would be the climber in Omicron. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the abyss. Okay, so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. Yeah, okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't implode while in the abyss. <laughs> that does sound useful. All right, let's go then. Okay. Wait, what is this place? Seems to be a lot of information on the art here. There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get on the Ark. Okay, maybe it wasn't so bad after all that we you ended up here. Get us on? How difficult could it be? Good question. She didn't even know how to get us on, right? Start an Ark simulation. I want to see how it works. Alright, uh, Ark. Attitude survey documents. My decision, Dr. Catherine Chun. I have decided to finalize the arc with the scans we have. I'm sorry for all of you who wanted to go but didn't get a chance to scan yourselves before the project was put to an on hold. It's been two months since I've added the scan and I don't see how I'll ever be able to win back the support you all showed me when we started the project. I'm sorry I never meant for anyone to take their lives. I was never my intention to fool anyone. I just wanted to save everything. Save something. Apply interf interf interference module. Seal arc capsule. Arc permission from 4Q. Brief in Verda. Take shuttle to Omicron. Pick up power suits. Ride the climber into the abyss. Regroup at Tau. Head to launch site. Load the bullet and launch arc. Load the bullet. That's how we were supposed to get in, huh? 
or R. Theta. Omicron. And then down into the abyss is the arc. And then launch that thing into space. That seems awesome. I want to do that. That, lo that looks like a good plan. Activating the vent ventilation a bit here. Uh, arc altitude, no, attitude survey. Uh, to God's staff opinion, please fill out the survey. Uh, recently, I was decided the ARC project could would become Pathos last official commitment. The staff has been urgent, uh, urgent, urged to carry on with their duties despite Earth's catastrophic condition. I think the ARC's project is the most logical step towards saving mankind, and that we should spend as much time and resources as needed to complete it. Strongly agree. Yes. To embark, every passenger needs to be flushed with the electromagnetism using a pilot seat. These scanning sessions are known to cause nausea and headaches, and sometimes last up to three days. I think temporary physical discomfort, no matter how severe, is a small price to save mankind. Strongly agree. Uh, the Ark is built to fit a Ranger Mark 7 probe, meaning to could it could be shot into space with the Omega space gun and technically survive for thousands of years living off the light of so uh, off the light from our sun and distant stars. I think the Ark should n should leave Earth behind and be launched into space. Uh, I agree, but I would I wish it would you know land not just in space somewhere but we could actually determine the destination the digitalization of human humanity is an opportunity to make an, a quantum leap in our own evolution the people inside the ark will out, uh, will out of necessity be, be generated from existing generic code but could be altered to allow for cosmetic changes ease aging and even prevent death I think we are at risk of losing our humanity if we were to rid ourselves of disease and our morality. I think we are at risk of losing our humanity if we were to rid, rid ourselves of disease and our morality. Morality, yes, we keep our we need to keep morality, um, but the disease and death, maybe, maybe we need death and disease in order to remain human. This is maybe part of what makes us human. So I agree. I agree. Kind of. There are only 58 people left alive to be stored inside the Ark. A way to diversify and expand the population would be in to introduce an artificial intelligence that would in every way appear to be human, but with childlike and native, uh, naive sensibilities. As we continue to explore the na nature of intelligence, we may find a way to make them smarter in the future. I think even an inferior group of artificial people would benefit our society. Kind of agree. Thank you for participating. This is how, how your colleagues voted. Strongly agree. Okay. Alright, interesting. Good. Um, that's the survey that we've just done. What's this? Some corridor. Swipe Omicron. Okay, uh, Omni tool, I mean. So this is how to continue on, but we first have to gather some data for something. Uh, you... Heimatsu power suit. Proper usage. For the safety of all of our colleagues. Put on the neoprene undersuit and body harness. Check the HPS for any visual damage. Start with the legs, fix the pants onto the harness, and work your yourselves upwards. Lock all the pieces together as you go. Let the par partner let a partner help you with the pa back piece and the torso. Put the secure bottom on your arm piece. You shall hear the suit seal itself. The suit will then start to equalize pressure and tap into oxygen tank. If the suit doesn't seal itself, flex the sh shack absorbers and try again. If it still won't work, do not try to fix it yourself. Contact maintenance. Note, the HPSs are very heavy and the suit will compensate. You will effectively be stronger than you think you are. Be careful. 
Regular draining applies. Don't hold your breath. Don't stay up out too long. Don't dive too deep. Don't dive with malfunction equipment. All right, interesting. Wow, that's so cool. It's the whole gang. A crew photo? Really? Who are you saving this for? The world was dead. Thanks, Simon. <laughs> I thought being an asshole wasn't invented until the 22nd century. <laughs> now I know better. Uh-huh. Um... Oh gosh, what is this? Hold on, do I need to write this down? I don't want to. Let's do it. I don't know. It seems it seems uh, it seems important. Although I don't think that you have to play the game writing things down all the time. Uh, this just doesn't sound right. E Y, and then the last one X X. Zero 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 one 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 AA. Okay. Prep arc with signal transmitter. Power packs. Tots FST kit. Extra oxygen and P two permission. That's Phi, all right. Quick stop at Omicron, then Tau, then Phi. Let's do it. Okay. Maybe I do have to touch this thing. Oh wait, there's something. Is this maybe where I get What's my this? suit? That's just a compound examiner. Coster uses it to investigate structural integrity and payload frameworks. Of course. Uh, I knew what you were made of. It would be a hell of a lot easier to figure out how to get you on the arc. Give it a try. Okay, let's figure that out. Fit. Can you reach the on switch? Uh, yes. <laughs> I'm aiming Should at I it. Worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Interesting. Ooh, this is we weird. Yeah, that's me together. aiming with the mouse. How's that gonna work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? Um, uh, now I'm, I'm getting dizzy. You should be able to wear them both. Look at that effect! Whoa, 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 whoa! Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the Ocu torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel is fused <laughs> what? the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 hold on, back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's disgusting. Hey, don't say that. She was my... She was nice to me. Wait, she- I got anyway, boobs? Are you saying I've got boobs? Because I don't see it. <laughs> that means we can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. Kath, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All those simplistic minds we've run into? Just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best of both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. Great. At least we know how to get on the line. Sort of. I understand the concept, but I don't know the specifics. I really wish we could figure out how the scan data is formulated and processed. Okay, so now that we know that, um... Yeah, I don't think there's any more to do for me here other than... Wait, what's that? <laughs> uh, other than press that thing. Usually something happens after this, something weird, some energy spikes. No device connected. Wait, what device do I need to connect? Get away chair. I can connect something here. Ah, wait a minute. What is this? What did I connect? Oh god, what is this? Memory corruption detected. 
Please reduce memory footprint. Memory. Oh, really? I have to simply delete people now? Terabytes. I am about 8,000 ter terabytes over. Third road. So my human. This is something with people. No, that's a road. Mud river. Okay, we can basically sh delete what I don't consider important for our arc or for the for the um, um, for the uh, um, simulation. So things that are big, Fl physics of fluid. I guess we can live with that. Without that, then a road, a boat, a river. 300 sun and noon clouds i don't like clouds as much i'd rather have clear skies anyways vegetation do not dynamic lighting or whatever heat in interface scan physics soft rigid All right, there we go. Next. Uh, required type water. This? No. It wants something. It says something is required. Mott River. Uh, required physics fluid. Okay, so these things are required. Some things are required and some are not. What if I just deactivate all of those things? And start from scratch. Sim base required type soma. That. Okay, and that requires forest. No, human, human, human. That. 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 Heat, but now it's too hot. Uh, too too far. Any removal of any of those parts. I don't understand this. Can I somehow increase the capacity maybe? Get an arc simulation going. Arc simulation going. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. This is more complex complex and complicated than I thought. I wonder if there's anything else I can utilize here. What's up with it? You know, with these cables. Usually in this game, you also follow cables and do things with that. Hmm. Not in this case, I think. We have to fiddle around with that PC thing. 
to scan the forest. How do I un deactivate the forest? Mott River, Mott Lake. Mott Lake is a bit smaller. Now I need soft. Now I'm way over it though. But I can deactivate fluid. Some type of water I need. That's too big. That's the smallest one I, I can get. Chair, river, boat, bench. Heat. Sun, maybe. There was something with sun somewhere. Where is the sun? This is more complex than I thought. Clouds? Noon required. We have noon. It's all my human required. Moon full. X moon full required. Physics fluid. That's too big, though. And now sun noon required. Heat. This is insane. Okay. That is 100% necessary. Vegeta vegetation too. This is, I don't know what to do here, ladies and gentlemen. We're so close. It's so, it's so freaking close, man. This is going to take a while. I'm going to figure out what this is all about and then I'm going to present you the result, okay? You don't have to stick with me for all this time. So I'm going to end the video episode here. It's already too long. I'm going to figure this out and then I'm going to tell you show you what the result was okay so until next time ladies and gentlemen bye bye